In this problem, we're given two different parametric equations and we're trying to find dy dx. So we're given that x equals t over 1 plus t and then y equals the square root of 1 plus t. So let's go ahead and solve. So in order to solve this, there's a formula you should know, which is that dy dx, essentially what we're solving for, is going to be equal to dy over dt over dx over dt. Right? So this right here is going to be the formula that we use to solve this. So what we need to do is find the derivative of our y function right here and then we need to find the derivative of the x function and that's going to go ahead and allow us to solve so let's start with finding dy dt so we know y equals this so let's find dy dt so dy dt the derivative of this since it's the square root of 1 plus t uh, essentially we can just rewrite this as 1 plus t to the 1 half right and then we can use the chain rule so imagine this is just x we move the 1 half out front and then we subtract one from the top. So it's gonna be one half times one plus t to the minus one half. And then we multiply by, by the derivative of the inside. And the derivative is just, or it's just one plus t, so the derivative is just one. So it doesn't really change anything. So yeah, this right here is gonna be dy dt. Let's do dx dt now. So in order to find dx dt, we're gonna to have to use the quotient rule. So let's go ahead and do that. So what we do is we take the derivative of the top, which is t, so, or it's t, so we're taking the derivative of t, which is 1, multiplied by the derivative of the bottom, which is 1, or not the derivative of the bottom, just uh, the bottom, so 1 plus t, minus this, just the top function, and then multiply by the derivative of the bottom function, which is uh, just going to be 1, right? Because uh, 1 plus t, the derivative of that is just 1. And then this is going to be over the bottom squared, so 1 plus t, uh, 1 plus t squared. Hopefully you still remember how to take uh, derivatives, but yeah. And we can simplify this here. So 1 times 1 plus t is just going to be 1 plus t. And then this is just going to be minus t. And so plus t minus t is just going to be 1. And then over the bottom squared. So 1 plus t squared. So now we've got dx dt, we've got dy dt. And we can just plug it in and go ahead and solve. So dy dx is going to be equal to dy dt, which is 1 half times 1 plus t to the minus one half over uh, dx dt. So dx dt is one over one plus t squared. And since this is one over it, if you use the, uh, if you use like copy dot flip, right, it's just gonna be multiplying by this, right? We're just multiplying by the bottom. So really it's just the top multiplied by the bottom since it's one over it. So we can just rewrite this as uh, one half times one plus t to the minus one half multiplied by 1 plus t squared. But yeah, so since these are the same, we can just multiply them together. So dy dx equals, so we have the 1 half out front. And then when we multiply uh, things with the same base, you just add their exponents. So 2 minus 1 half is 3 over 2. So it's going to be 1 half times 1 plus t. So 1 half times 1 plus t to the 3 over 2. Right? 2 minus 1 half is 3 over 2. So, yeah, this right here is going to be your answer. 1 half times 1 plus t raised to the 3 over 2. So that's dy dx. And, yeah, so hopefully you found this useful.